Welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy IX! Last time we defeated Quail, and this time we are heading on in the story. Here we go. Ships clear a path for the invincible. Can't let you guys steal the show by yourselves. <laughs> Uncle Sid? How did he even know to show up here? Probably because of Baku. He loves big showdowns. Now let's lose those dragons. General Beatrix, our ship is going to burst! Do not fret. The captain is about to enter Valhalla. You are a Pluto Knight. Now act like one! We all know you came because you were worried sick about Captain Steiner. Did you say something? Uh. Red Rose, could it be Beatrix? Quite a woman you fell in love with. You're one to talk. Wait a minute, Steiner. What did you mean by that? All right, let's bust through. And we enter a random boss fight versus the Nova Dragon. And three words. Ribbon pones this. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, this thing has uh, two main sources of attacks. Wind attacks and water attacks. Both of which are absorbed. Uh -huh. I'm keeping the same party in the same setup as I did in the last episode. Uh, just because I want to get these guys up in levels. Queena is actually Queena is the lowest level character I have right now, to be honest. And um, aside from stealing its three items, you know, mainly the armor because the armor is kick ass. But uh, I also want to show off the Soul Blade of the ultimate weapon because this thing has one status infliction, which is going to make this a little bit easier and avoid me accidentally killing this thing with counterattacks. <laughs> Which is the Soul Blade, the ultimate weapon's added status is. Sleep! So you can put this dragon to sleep. Which ought to make things a little bit easier to steal. Gives you more quality stealing time with the, uh. Zidane. Oh, and it already woke up. Really? Wow, that was like nothing. Um. Yeah. Couldn't steal anything. I'm just gonna let Auto Regen do all the healing. Oh, never mind. I'm gonna let him heal me. Oh, look at that. Oh, Queena has something that guards against wind, that nullifies wind, which is stopping the healing. Oh, this one will be absorbed. This is the water attack. Oh, look at that. It's a good healing. But yeah, Ribbon pones this dude. 
This thing does have a counterattack when you physically attack it, but I probably won't be doing so. Stop doing that! Don't kill it! <laughs> yes! Okay, good, we're good. Time to kill. Okay, let's see here. Uh, holy, let's see how much damage uh, Frog Drop does. And let's attack. So let's continue the quadruple nine it. The quadruple nine fest. Yes, it does! Actually, I already knew it does. did, because didn't I use that in the first turn? Oh well. Moving on. <laughs> I suppose if you had, uh... Does Vivi know Arrow? Does Vivi have a wind magic? I can't remember. Uh, whatever. Let's just keep going, because it's about to die. Oh, that's a wind magic. Causes wind damage to all enemies. Let's try the Twister. Never mind! <laughs> I guess we won't try Twister. <laughs> well, goodbye, Nova Dragon. Epic slowdown! And this psychedelic boss battle is over. 13 AP, which is useless to me, because everybody in my party knows every ability now, so... AP is useless. Oh well. Oh, we're actually using a portal. You sure this will work, Aquina? It's no problem! I warped him in from outside before! I guess this is the only way... the only exit, anyway. We find same magic field outside when we come in back. I warp in when I step into magic field outside. Alright, I guess there's no use worrying. Don't leave Queena on his or her own. She might not come! <laughs> she might just go off in the ship and smell something in the ship and go and eat it. <laughs> oh, hello. What is this place? Huh? What's wrong, Zidane? Did someone just call my name? No. That's weird. Maybe you're just hearing things. I don't think so. You hear that? I hear nothing. Zidane, can you hear me? Garland! I am speaking only to you. Garland, what is this place? Memoria, a place of memories. Memories? Yes, your memories brought for uh, brought forth this place. Here you shall witness the entire truth. You have no choice. Now go. What are you talking about? Damn! Zidane, what's going on? You all heard me talking, right? Looks like we're the only I was the only one who could hear him. Heard him. I was just talking to Garland. He told me that our memories created this place. I don't know what the hell he's talking about. I guess we'll have no choice but to move forward. Well, I'm just going to keep the same team. I'm going to keep it in. Because I don't want to have to reorganize everything. Let's just keep going. We are now entering Memoria. Which is apparently being built. Whoa, what was that? Okay, return to the Invincible. You can return to the ship from here. Uh, also, there's uh, every save point in here like this, you're able to tent and select party members. So you can change your party right here. Also, I think they act as teleporters later on. I can't remember, though. Alrighty! Now that we have magically teleported through this ball of weirdness, uh, we're gonna head over here and find this thing, which is Kane's Lance! Kane is a character from Final Fantasy IV. I can't remember if that's the proper number in Japanese or not. And obviously, since it's a lance, um, it appears to be probably her second best weapon. So it has a lot of good skills. Dragon Crest, Cherry Blossom, Bite Draw. Those are some fairly good skills. What does, what does Cherry, Cherry Blossom just does with damage, doesn't it? 
non-elemental damage to all enemies. Yeah, okay. We're gonna go on. Fight? What kind of monster can we fight in here? Uh, if you are having trouble with the monsters in this dungeon, the, uh, the para- the, uh, petrification abilities of the, uh, big thing still work here. Um, but pretty much I'm just gonna drag across everything. <clears throat> I'm pretty much gonna use the same thing I was doing to all the mon- all the bosses from now- from here on. Um, uh, yeah! I don't know how much damage this thing can take. It obviously has over 10,000 damage, but it doesn't have that much over, because I think, the th I think a Mug does a fraction of the damage, like a fraction of the health, but I don't know. Maybe not. Fist. Hey, he punched me. I didn't see that coming. Okay. Phoenix down. Trying to power up Thief. It's not, it's a slow going process. Or uh, thievery. Let's see if it actually lives through this. I'll use thievery. Of course, knowing my luck with this situation, it's going to keep this thing going to kill him. So, see, whenever I try testing something, it always kills it. I always kill it before I can actually implement my test. Ah. Okay, let's just keep going here. Okay, let's go. Uh, this place is pretty much a uh, straightforward path, so you just have to keep running. That's basically it. Let's keep going! That was a veteran I just fought, by the way, so if you didn't get, uh... Oh, what was it? Doom? I think it was Doom? Okay, that monster had a lot of... Chimera had a, a freezing ability, so I'm going to... also had Venom, so I'm going to try to get a uh, body temp on here. Without losing... Uh, without losing the uh, antibody. Uh, you know what, I'm just going to go. Good old-fashioned that. Uh... We're going to lose what with you. Crap. Oh, well, we'll just let you suffer for now. HP can go away for body temp. And uh, you can lose nothing either. Cool, I have two susceptible, and they are both my healers. That's not nice. Okay. I knew this was a better place to train. Oh, right down here, the tower! Yay. Okay, we're gonna move up here now. Large arcing slope, and I think there's actually a boss fight up ahead. All right here! Ahem! <laughs> that was kind of sudden. Anyways, this is Malurus. If you recall, we didn't fight this thing, but it was in the... We meet again. I am one of the Chaos Guardians. Kneel before my power. Yeah, we uh, didn't get to fight her, but this is the chick that was at the uh, Fire Temple with Freya and uh, Amarant. Oh, and it just casted Reflect on itself. Cool. Genji armor! Oh my god! First steal! <laughs> oh, you are so screwed, lady! <laughs> okay, um... Unfortunately, this thing has the ability to... This is, I wanted body temp instead of antibody for this, but this battle just sort of snuck up on me. Oh, and uh, Echo is actually kind of low on health. Dude, my last fight against an iron thingamajigger that actually did... Uh, Something called Helm Divide, which actually took my damage down to one. My health down to one. Okay, good, it's on one of the people with body temp. That's gonna be very annoying in this fight. 
Okay, let's use another Dragon Crest so I can get rid of it as quickly once I am done stealing everything. Couldn't steal anything. You stole the Genji armor, but now you are, like, missing everything else, really. Ugh. At least Aiko's back up to full health. There goes another quadruple nine. Stole Massamoon. And there should be one more weapon to take. Hi. Uh, if you also, if you have any fire absorbing uh, abilities, uh, equipment, take it. Because uh, this chick has a lot of fire skills. As you just saw. Soul Ultima Sword. I think that is my cue to pwn. Oh, okay, don't pwn. Uh, make, go to Freya and pwn with her. Okay, now I can pwn with the others, because... Yeah. Uh, holy... Um, this thing's weak to ice. Do I have anything ice-wise in here? I don't think so. I have water. But no ice. So let's just go with the good old frog drop. Uh, we don't need to steal anymore, so we shall just use regular attacks to see how much this damage does, and to see if thievery is better now, because uh, I, did, I did use thievery in a battle, and it was just over 5,000 against that enemy, but... We will take a peek at how much damage Zidane is dealing with his Ultima weapon. Assuming it lives. <laughs> Again, it's the testing curse I have. Bam! Ooh, thievery might do more, except all oh, this is a boss, so... Ooh, I am so hurt. Frog drop. Ah, uh, this is probably gonna kill it pretty soon. Om nom nom! Told ya! There it goes. Oh, right. Uh, when he, this thing dies, uh, she casts Raining Swords. Ah, oh, Trance! Really? Trance? Oh, my God. Just, uh... Damn it, Sedane! <laughs> you could literally completely wasted a trance. Like, it wasn't even a wasted turn. You activated the trance after the enemy was dead. Oh my god. You gotta be kidding me. Anyways, that's it for this episode. We're, next time, we're continuing on in the, the, the memoria. See you guys then.